Bakhtarak Alpharetta, and today we're going to be uh, commenting and reacting to. Ooh. We will be reacting to Billie Eilish at the Grammys. She's live. Here we go. All right. So what are your thoughts on her breath support? Yeah, so I mean, Billie Eilish's voice is so unique because, mm -hmm. right, it, it's like a whisper. It makes you want to lean in and, and, and hear more. Mm -hmm. um, so at the beginning, you know, all that part is, is, I thought was really good, but then when she got up higher, she needed more air. And that's why she didn't, you know, I think she's kind of playing it off as she's like emotional about mm -hmm. it like the song is really deep and and it's like she's kind of making it seem like a choice when really I think it's a it's, it's a, a lack support of support yeah. I worry about the longevity of the sound that she's producing uh, because I feel like it's 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 like she's not quite getting where she needs to go placement wise so I get worried about her long-term vocal health mm -hmm. yeah yeah, so I, I'm familiar with this song. I've, I've heard it before. Um, so she's going to hit this note again later. Mm -hmm. And so we'll see if maybe she has more okay. air. Call me friend, but keep me closer. And I'll go. So I think we're we're seeing a lack of support here. She has beautiful yeah. tone in her voice, mm -hmm. um, but she's almost keeping it placed in a very covered sense. If that makes do, yeah. do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's it's almost like that classical placement, straight up and down, mm -hmm. but it's not quite getting there because she doesn't quite have the support. But a beautiful quality. I would love to hear what her real voice sounds like when you take out the way she's yeah. kind of putting on that pop sound to it yeah yeah and I and, and I know that she has like this uh, choral background mm -hmm. so she has uh, legit she's been taught legit technique mm -hmm. um, I don't think she's using it to the fullest potential but she's also really young she's, she's only like 17 I think right I, I think the talent and what we'll see out of her in the future is um, kind of an exciting thing to think how she will yeah. evolve as a performer but I have to say, all I can really pay attention to are those green fingernails. I know. <laughs> right? They're almost yeah. terrifying. There, she has better placement. Yeah. She's using her breath a little bit more effectively mm -hmm. and a little bit more efficiently. And mm -hmm. um, that is a very nice placement that she has right there. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, I agree. Yeah. Like like Interesting vowel there at the end. Um, like it, like they, they. They, what is the actual word she's saying? That. That. Like it, like oh, that. Okay. so it was the same word. Overall, I think it's a very nice song. Will it last through the ages? Mm -hmm. um, or will it be something that someone listens to and says, wow, that's so 2020? Yeah. 
Yeah, I mean, just her sound is just, it, it's just so unique. I don't think I've ever heard anything like it before. And for her to be able to write these songs at the young age that she yes. is, um, is it, it's, it's, it's very impressive. Well, you can tell by listening to her that she has a good technique that she has learned, whether that be through choral music or private lessons. Um, and, and she's definitely putting on a pop sound. Um, a little bit more breath support, I think, would help her get to those higher notes more consistently. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, and there is a way to, ha to achieve that whisper kind of sound with a little bit more breath support. It, it is possible to do both. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But overall, I really like the song. Yeah. She's very talented. Yeah, very good performance. Mm -hmm. Very good. Good job, Billy. Yay! Well, thank you guys so much for joining us today. That was us reviewing uh, Billie Eilish's When the Party's Over from the 2020 Grammy Awards. Uh, we hope you enjoyed it. Feel free to uh, follow us, and we'll see you next time. Yep, yeah, bye from Back to Rock.